What is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Paul and in today's video we'll be doing more of organization in my shop. So let's get to it. All right, as you can see, I already got first aisle, second, third. Um, this one, I actually am going to redo. I'm thinking of removing both of these and creating three shelves instead of two. Um, just because I'm running out of big items to put on the shelf. So, and I got this one's kind of big for some big items. This shelf is kind of opened up for some big items also so i'm gonna i might even put um which i mean this one that one and that one i might remove all three leave the top one as is uh but remove all three and then put either one or two more in there um i am gonna make a glass rack for all my windows i'll probably just make a little um, divider of some sort so they're about a foot apart that way you can actually get stuff out without having to place everything or move things around but yeah so far doing pretty good as you can see all my barcodes um i literally had about 20 um columns of shelves and or 20 sections, I would say, sections of the shell. And then I've compiled everything into literally like six. So that kind of gives me more ideas for the future and more planning. As you can see, I got all my cushions, some of the shields, dashboards, bumpers, door panels, all my doors, which took a while because these things are not light. And then whenever you just do all of the all of them at once it kind of becomes a little heavy so uh right now i'm gonna go into my truck i brought some two by fours i'm gonna build the little dividers for the windows and then i'm hopefully gonna get that shell filled up today
All right, added those shelves. And then this bigger one is gonna be for all my glass. Right here, there's more, 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 and more. There's a lot of glass. So uh, what I'm gonna be doing is basically making a frame. I got some two by fours. Um, and it's basically gonna look just like this, like the upper uh, shipping station. See how it has the slots? But the face of it would be out of two by four and the space would probably be like a foot or maybe 16 inches in center, something like that. So I'll just make it that way. And that way I can just slide in the glass. And then whenever something sells in the middle, we don't have to like lay all the glass down to just pull it out. We'll have enough room to move it back and forth. So that's basically the idea I got um, for the windows or for the glass. So yeah, let's chop all of it up and get it installed. got one of them done I am gonna wrap it up today it's already almost 11 o'clock at night so got one I'm gonna build three of these for every shelf so one would be in the middle and one at the back and I might just throw plywood underneath it just just in case it would fall but I'm assuming if I have three of these uh, frames built there's no chances of it falling and I'll just put a 2 by 4 across it maybe two or three just to kind of hold all this together but yeah this would be way easier picking glass and that way this one right here on this one it would be a two a three a four a five and a six so that's the idea i'm also going to make this one into the glass shelf as well i think two would be enough as you can see, I only have like five or six here, three, maybe another ten, so not too much. And this is all over five years. This The glass sells pretty quick for me, so I don't really hold that much of it in stock and down the road if we have to. I'll leave this one the same shape or the same height as that one, but as soon as I need... To use it for glass, I'll use it, but for now, it'd probably be used for something else. And the way I'm thinking I'm going to be doing stuff is the way I have things on this side of the shelf. You see how I started from the back and just filling it up. So let's say as soon as this fills up, we'll start from here. But if we do sell things off of it, um, I think I'm just going to use either some post-it notes, just mark it. Like, let's say we pulled off this door panel, we'll just put a post-it note so we know next time we bring a new part in, we know to fill this shelf in before we start filling up. So, that's kind of my idea. We'll see how it works out. But for today, that'll be a wrap. I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, please comment if you have any questions. Like this video, subscribe to see more. Um, let me know what you guys think. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.